My work takes place um, out in the landscape. So um, none of the actual painting or drawing happens in the studio. Being out in the place, in the elements, is, is really central to my work. So I pack up my car and take everything with me and, and set up and it's sort of like an endurance activity, just standing out, standing out in the elements and, and making the work and being in the landscape. The painting that's in the exhibition, it's, it's a multi-panel painting. So um, typically when I'm oil painting, like the, also the painting that's behind me, I, I work one canvas at a time um, at different elevations, different vantage points throughout a specific spot in the landscape, re uh, visiting repeatedly over time, really getting to know that place. Each painting happens over the course of a couple of days, um, as long as it takes, and um, then I build the next canvas and go out and do the next one. And when I return to the studio, it's always exciting to see how, how those different um, vantage points, how those different um, views of this landscape up close, far away, up high, down low, how that can start to construct something much more, much more complex of how it is that a site, we actually experience, experience a place in the landscape and all of those layers of, of history and geology and um, climate, it's all sort of packed in there. Um, the drawings themselves, um, they take place usually over the course of a couple of hours. Um, I sort of see them as as research and a way to get to know the logistics a bit of the spot that I want to return to. Like, how can I get out here? How can I bring all my stuff? And really start to like improvise with the space in a way that's um, very immediate and very quick with ink. I'm not thinking about mixing colors. It's, you know, almost quick enough that I can keep up with what my eye is seeing. Something I'm finding particularly beautiful about the light is how much you can see the sky and the shadows on the sand. And this is something in theory I know happens. I could always see it in the snow if I'm painting in the snow, but you can really see it on the sand. So I find that when I'm painting, there's something that happens where you know, I spend forever mixing this color that's in the shadow on the sand. And then I put it down. I'm like, wait, I just mix, mix this color for the sky. So everything is reflecting into everything else. And it just creates this kind of bounce back, glowing, luminous thing. And, um, and it's always different every day. And I love how painting can kind of hold every day's bits of light and wind and weather and just kind of build up over time. Mm -hmm.